Hi, welcome back to our life on the homestead. Today we are going to be harvesting the last of the salad greens in our indoor winter garden um, and then prepping the flats to get seeds in there so we can get some seeds started. Um, the plan is to get our tomatoes, brassicas, and onions and peppers started. So while Andy's working today, I am going to be cleaning it out and prepping it so that we can get those planted maybe tomorrow. Anyway, let's go harvest some salad greens for lunch. All right, and here's how everything's doing. The arugula was actually bolting, so I trimmed it. But our salad will be romaine, arugula, and buttercrunch lettuce. The spinach hasn't done super great, and this is also a failed, um, one of those living lettuce situations. That didn't go well, so that's gonna go in compost. The spinach didn't do super great, as you can see, and there's like white on it, so we're actually probably not gonna eat that. We're going to leave the kale in Swiss chard and these herbs, because these will be up potted, so, and my plan is to have like an herb pot that will, yeah. We're gonna leave, start over. We are going to leave the kale and Swiss chard because these will actually be transitioned to outside. And we're gonna leave these herbs and then everything down. You can see how well the basil is doing, the dill and parsley and the cilantro. So all of this is gonna stay in those pots. We will actually be moving them outside during the day and then bringing them right inside our patio door at night. But today we have like 25 mile per hour wind. So those are not gonna go outside today. And this is a little kind of science project my older daughter is doing. Um, so the plan is to harvest these things. Not quite sure what we're gonna do with the onions yet. Um, but harvest the lettuces and then take everything outside and then put some new... This is probably the third time I've harvested lettuce off of it. It's a win. It's a redo for me. Next winter we are certainly doing this again. Oh hey! Alright, so we are a few days later. But today what we are going to do, we are going to fill the seed trays and we are going to get some things started. So let's get on to that, and then we will take them inside and we will be planting some seeds. I'm excited. Are you excited? Let's go. Mommy. Oh, hello. But you are. Let me just uh, hmm? go down to the shop. Can okay. I get some? Yeah. Put it in 
here. Put it in here. Oh, careful not to spill any. Okay, that's enough, thank you. Fancy tea cups. Mm. All right, so I already explained it. We're planting our seeds today for our yes. stuff that has to be mm -hmm. ideally to start stuff inside. Yep, so this is Minnesota season. Woo. We can't grow all the stuffs by planting it right out in the soil. We've got to start some of our stuff right now at the end. Of March and in some cases some of these things we could have started even maybe two weeks ago yet uh, so we're just we getting right now no. for the most part we're using these small six packs so we don't want really big plants by the time we're going to plant we're looking for like four inch plants so that mm -hmm. they don't outgrow their containers too much and their roots are all in a ball and then they just take a real big setback when they get out in the garden so um, today we're just gonna go through and Go through our seeds here. We got all planned out. And we have little oh. sticks. We finally took mm -hmm. a little hint on that and got some mm -hmm. labeling sticks mm -hmm. for this year. So uh, what, what do you want to start on first, honey? Um, I wanna, don't know. Do just, you want to tackle that tray and I'll tackle this? Wanna dive into the tomatoes? Yeah. You want to do tomatoes? Okay. Should we start planting? Let yeah. Me, I'll, I'll, let me finish my tea and then let's we'll do it. Okay, let's go. Q music. Thank you. 
for now. <laughs> all done. We got these seeds all set. I'm gonna finish watering them really quick. Andy's got a meeting to run to. And yeah, he'll be adjusting some of the lights and we'll show you that setup in another video, but it's all done. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how many plants that was, honey, but 72 times four plus another three, four dozen. That's a lot. Yep. But it's we're going to have a lot of stuff to plant in about black thumb right now. About four to six weeks. Yep. So that's the time frame we're looking for to start. About six weeks we'll probably look at putting this stuff out in the garden. So we'll keep you along and give, maybe give you an update after everything comes up and let you know how things are growing. Thanks for sticking around for the video. Have a good one.